Easy there, boy. I'm almost done. Hey, Rocky, Shoot it. right? You run cabins. Oh, Mr. Wake. I'd shake your hand, but mine are kind of full here. Snap it, snack. Actually, I'm sorry about this. Would you mind grabbing the registration form from the desk? It's just across from Bucktooth Charlie. I can pick up a crowbar, too. Sure. What happened? Crazy poachers. Max here got his foot caught in a trap. They're illegal to use here. Hell, you're not supposed to hunt within the park at all. But that doesn't stop some lowlifes. <sighs> well, Do the Max job right, here. guys. You got lucky. I didn't. Max is still groggy from the shot I gave him, and I'd rather not leave him alone just yet. The form's on the desk across from the mammoth skeleton. Give him another injection. Or two. Or five. However many it takes. Seriously, Al, you can't just go and meet a kidnapper. Those situations always end up in disaster. I'll bring an autograph, it'll be fine! She's my wife, and it's my call. Can we talk about this later? I need to go kill a dog. This whole thing... Listen, you hit your head. I mean, jeez, Al, come on. You got Mine? How crazy all this sounds. If you're trying to pull a joke on me, freak me out, it's working. Ha ha, let's have a laugh on Barry. Well, you had me going... Uh, there, Barry, where did that plant come from? Quit it now. And why is it perpetually rolling? I think we've just discovered the secret to free energy. Rider kick! Or stomp, that works too. Alright. Is that a humidifier? Yeah, cool. Alright, is it dead yet? Hand over for him. I think don't, 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 don't put your hand near its head! Are the keys. Okay, you're all set, Mr. Wake. Glad to have you stand here. Oh, Thanks. fuck. Can you tell me how to get to Lover's Peak? Um... Oh, sure. It's at the end of the nature trail. Just follow the yeah. paths, you'll get to it eventually. It's an easy walk. Nice spot, too. I hate those things. If you have any trouble finding it, just keep your eyes on the radio mast. It's right below that. Oh, and hey, if you take a walk in the woods, watch your steps so you don't end up like Max. I guess I'm a little worried. We got a bunch of campers out there we haven't heard from. It's huh. not like these people are on a schedule, but with the traps, well, you know. I just don't want any trouble. Right. Thanks. Now, is that the dog that we heard running off into the forest and then never came back? Al, you're asking me to believe that you shot a dude who went, poof, into thin air. I shot several of them, actually. Bulletproof until you pointed a flashlight at him. You hear that from people who end up spending time in padded rooms, strapped to their beds, wearing white shirts with two long tangled up sleeves, and eating a healthy diet of pills. Science pills? Al, you make cruel jokes about people who believe that kind of stuff. You're the skeptic. You gave me an hour-long lecture on homeopathy last month. Huh? It? If there's no proof, it's pure bullshit. Period. Guess the laugh's on me, then. Al, come on! I mean, okay. Okay, maybe something weird happened to you, okay? Well, he needs glasses. He just looks so oh, weird without you aviators. Gotta throw me a bone here, bestseller. What would you think if it was me? There's no way you should be going out at midnight with a gun. No one asked you to come here, Barry. Either work with me on this or go straight back to New York. Your choice. <sighs> what the fuck was that? You just, just start making the sign of the cross and then give up halfway through? All right, all right. Oh! This is what he was talking about. Holy shit, that's huge. Uh, skeleton, specimen, something. <clears throat> Just a minute, Barry! National Park, combined, named Bucktooth Charlie, has since become the park's official mascot. Will there be tar pits? I want to know. Alright. Uh, moose. A... Buffalo or bison? Kind of tricky, tricky to tell. Oh, you are coming with me. All right. Uh, an elk. G gator. We got alligator here and stegosaurus. What a fucking park is this? Oh, I suppose that explains the Jurassic Park thing. All right. Um. 
Uh, so, <laughs> I didn't look up earlier. Uh, Elderwood... Uh, locked. Locked. Or we could just actually try the handle for once, instead of just pushing on the door. Uh, water cooler. I'm looking around for prizes. Want to be thorough here. Sorry for wasting your time, guys, but I want to be thorough. I have now been thorough. Let us leave. Come on, Barry! Hope that parka's waterproof. Alright, and in we go. Ow. Ow? We should go to the sheriff or call the FBI. Damn it, Barry, they'll kill her. This, this is lamp knocking over bad! I'm going Bless to peak. He said to come alone. Okay, okay then. I understand. You're my best friend, and I'm worried that you're not right in the head. I'm just worried that you're not right in, actually. You stay here, and if I'm not back by morning, call the cavalry. Bless you! Bless you. Just be careful with the natives, Al. These yokels are dangerous. Everybody hates a tourist. Or it'll be deliverance all over again. Did you have to bring that up? Bless you. Oh, this place is trying to kill me. I bet there's mold in here, spores, poison ivy, God knows what. This is so not worth a 15% commission. Really? Only 15%? Oh, wait, for who? You or me? Lock Probably to you. Alright, yes. Coffee. Locked. Uh, 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 uh. Batteries. Uh, switch on the lights. Switch off the lights, I should have said. Okay, I'm not seeing any more manuscript pages. Or any more coffee. All right, off we go. <sighs> Barbecue. I wonder if the petrol costs extra. Oh, <sighs> all right. Like I said, want to be thorough here. Just sort of looking around. Oh, there you go. Coffee. And a jacuzzi. Maybe we could use this to travel back in time. That would be ridiculous. Oh, wishing well. Hello? Oh. Oh, it's covered up. Oh, partially covered up. What? Oh, it's not a well? It's not a well at all! What is the point of that? Uh, stump. Um, I see nothing. Um, although I did find out that I did not miss a page last time, at least uh, not an available page. Apparently, some pages are only available on nightmare difficulty mode, which uh, I don't remember if I pointed that out earlier, but. Uh, Looks like I'm gonna have to play this play through this game again if I want to get everything. Uh, probably not on camera. In fact, I'm gonna guarantee it not on camera. Whatever you say. All right. Oh, that looks like a manuscript page over there. Okay, very movable dumpster. How did I miss this when I was getting out of the truck? Barry had never gotten along with Alice, but he knew Alan loved her with an almost frightening intensity. It was fucking terrifying. To Alice. And here was Al armed with a gun and saying things people got put in padded cells for. It was as if his friend had experienced a massive psychotic episode and was now totally disconnected from reality. It scared the shit out of Barry. All right. Let's see here. What's anything of use? I don't think so. 
Oh, I was afraid of this. Between each chapter, you only get the, uh, a few number of items. So that flare gun I was saving up, no longer any good. Also, the shotgun has mysteriously disappeared. That kind of bites. I, I like it when I can, you know, save up ammo and then at the very end just blast and gung-ho for the last final levels, but, uh... I should have gone to the cops. This wasn't the smartest thing I'd ever done, but I was still angry with Barry for trying to talk me out of it. These people had called me right in the sheriff's station. The cops wouldn't scare them, and they had Alice. Well, let's take the truck. Barry had the keys to the car he rented. It wasn't a long walk to the visitor center, and it wouldn't be any use to me in the forest. Ugh. Got to make things more difficult. Uh, let's just get on and find some shadow zombies to kill, or whatever you call them. I think they were called the Taken earlier. I remember one of the manuscript pages referring to them as such. Although this chapter is referring to the Taken as... Alice being kidnapped, which I still don't quite get how that works in with the whole... Shadow zombie thing, but... Let's check out this. Whoa, whoa, whoa! I missed something, I missed something, I know I missed something, what, what was it? Fuck, what did I miss? I hate it when the fucking scary shit comes when I don't- when I'm not looking! I had the exact same problem in fear. Alright, let's... Something down there. I hate it when it does that! Let's check out this cabin first. Potted plant. Uh, this looks promising. Snowshoes! Um, Traveler's Bible. Turn on the radio. Welcome back to the show, folks. As promised, our very own Dr. Nelson has just parked his rear end in the studio. Doc, what's your deer fest plan like? My plan? You make it sound a lot more organized. Sometimes a banana is just a banana! <laughs> and we laugh for no real reason. Really, just taking the atmosphere. I'm getting a little too rickety to do much more than that, you know. Oh, tell me about it. No sack race for us older gentlemen, huh? Our sacks drag on the ground! That's exactly that. But I'm gonna check out the parade, of course. And I'll be one of the pie contest judges, too. <laughs> uh, well, that takes a different kind of constitution. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's my kind of exercise. <laughs> Sitting on my fat ass and eating pie. Shape, though. You're the outdoors type. I, I know for a fact you're an avid fisherman. That's right. Matter of fact, just caught a heck of a large mouth. Bass oh, it's this guy. Morning. But you're not taking part in the fishing contest? No, no, not this year. Um, see, Pat, I'm just not that competitive anymore. Now I just like to take my time and enjoy the peace of it. It's not <sighs> so I to worry about what I'm catching, you know? Well, considering your track record, the participants are probably pretty happy you feel that way. <laughs> How do you do really well in fishing? I mean, really, aside from... It all comes down to the gear that you got in luck. I mean, there's no real skill involved into it. And I can guess full well right now I'm going to have a ton of people in the comments saying, No! Fishing is a really intense sport! It takes a lot of concentration and athletic superiority! You're putting a stick with a piece of twine on the end out with a worm and hoping something eats it. And hoping that thing that eats it is big. I'm not saying it ain't fun, I'm just saying it doesn't require a lot of skill. Uh, danger. Hazard. Hmm. Yeah! 